<laughs> What's going on, Amp Fam? Hope you're having a great morning, afternoon, evening, whatever since watching this video. Today's purpose of the video is you know, we change the spin on filter for the Allison 6 speed transmission. And I'm sure it works down, down to the uh, 5 speeds as well. But it's just going to be the external red spin on filter. Uh, really simple to do. So it's going to take probably five minutes out of our day to do it. And it's going to be this guy right here. Ooh. Right there. And that one's a little gunked up. It's been a good little minute since we changed it, but uh, I'm gonna show you a good way to keep track of how you change your filters. And when you do it, it's just like the mechanics do. You're gonna just write your date on it and the miles of your vehicle once you do it on the opposite side that you won't be able to see it from the underside of the vehicle. So that's some way it's an eyesore, but uh, let's get to it. All right, I'm just gonna go show you the basic tools and items that you need to get this filter out. Uh, what you're going to need is a replacement filter. Uh, the best filter to do it is the Allison OEM one. Uh, couldn't get one on hand fast enough, so we just go ahead and, or went ahead and got this out of O'Reilly's. Uh, filter wrench, and then some transmission fluid. It may be a hair low under the midway for half to full range once you check it again. But follow me under the truck real quick. I'll show you just how simple this is to do. Alright, so you're going to get your filter wrench. Place it on there. You know, counterclockwise turn until you can do it with your hand. Now most people think that all the fluid is just going to come and just keep coming, but it's not. It's only going to be a little bit. Okay, simple as that. All right, now easy way to tell when you change your filters is obviously a good old mechanic trick. You're gonna write the day's date on it and your miles. So I'm at 241, I think it's like 230 or something like that. So with every 10,000 miles, so just change this for every other old change. So I'm gonna write today's date, which is 20, 6, it's 13th, right? Mm -hmm. 13 and then I'm gonna do my miles 241 200 so that way I know around 251 I should replace this so you're gonna leave it up with some fresh transmission fluid Start by hand first. Last one wasn't on there snug at all. Probably don't need to use this. One turn of that, wipe filter off. Now, I'm just gonna go ahead and recheck your fluids and you should be done. All right, I want your truck is at normal operating temperature with the transmission as well. Just gonna pull the transmission dipstick out. Get a nice old check. Mine, I might have to add a little bit of fluid, but once you do that, simple as that ladies and gentlemen so if you did learn anything today or you like today's video drop a like and subscribe if you know anybody needing this fix to their vehicle transmission Alice and spin on filter change go ahead and send them this link and until next time man friends it's my statement I didn't grind it too damn hard yeah not a mason yeah nah 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 this my statement my statement took a few bunch I ended up on the pavement nah 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 this my statement I'm telling y'all I'm different, this ain't basic uh -huh. Nah, 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 this my statement Shit ain't like old times, yeah, gotta face it uh -huh. Nah, 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 this my statement Done jumped in the booth, now shit go crazy uh, You know I had to tell them pay me uh, Can't do no freebies, this shit crazy uh, Going around town, oh yeah, they looking uh, Stop by the BP, talk the wood, yeah